Crushed bamboo panels, also called Esterilia in Spanish, Tinaxa in Visayan, or Tinadra in Milongo, are boards made from flattened bamboo poles. These panels are used for various applications mainly in the furniture and construction industry. Crushed bamboo can be used for numerous applications. Although it could be used in its normal form, more often than not, certain manipulations such as sanding, shredding, and pressing are performed to make it more suitable for its specific end use. Flattened bamboo is also cheaper to transport than round poles, which makes it a very attractive resource for manufacturers of value-added bamboo products for flooring, furniture, particle boards, and composite beams, and etc. You Lafos everyone, it's another wonderful adventure day here in Virni Culture. Today, we are going to Barangay Katigan in Turil, Davao City together with a team from AOF Foundation and Tadeco Livelihood and Training Center. Oh, say hi! <laughs> We are going to observe the training conducted by TLTC and AUF Foundation on Crash Bamboo Making to some members of the community here in Katigan. Flooring. Oh, this is flung. He grew up uh, bamboos. Bamboo. Since pa bata pa siya. Bamboo Our expert. <laughs> expert na. Oh. So this time. So what are we doing today? Today uh, he will show us. Paano gagawin yung tad-tad in Visaya? In Ilonggo? Tad-tad nga po. Tad-tad nga po. Sa Visaya is yun yung sinasa. Sa Tiboli, Flom, ano yan, Flom? Sinasa. Sinasa siya? Sinasa. Tamasa. Okay. Pero ang 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 ginagamit gamito na to na bambu today is? Di ano yan? Ang sana variety? Ang tao niya, lasak, no? Oo, lasak. Making even a single crush bamboo panel is not easy because it involves a lot of process. The most laborious and time-consuming is the flattening process. Crush bamboo panels are made by flattening round bamboo poles. It is crucial that fresh-cut green bamboo poles of about 4 to 6 months old are used since green bamboo is easier to split and clean than dried bamboo. Breaking the nodes of the bamboo with the hatchet is the first step of the flattening process. The second step is to make one vertical incision in the bamboo with a spade so that all the nodes are completely perforated. Once all the nodes are broken, it is fairly easy to open the bamboo and crush it with the mallet to end up with a flat bamboo panel. As I've said, crushed bamboo can be used for numerous applications. Although it could be used in its normal form, more often than not, certain manipulations such as sanding, shredding, pressing are performed to make it more suitable for its specific end use. Esterilia is frequently used as a bamboo wall or ceiling panels in tropical architecture. Staining or painting the bamboo can also add extra color and character to the interior. 
The combination of bamboo and natural plasters make these walls earthquake resistant, extremely durable yet non-toxic and biodegradable. Also very effective for sound and temperature insulation, fire retardant, and water resistant. Bumba, ang kadugay. Five months, ma ready for harvest. Dendro calamus asper. I'm not so sure. Dendro calamus asper. That's the species of the bamboo. Tapos kani siya flom. Ah, ilan dito ang pwede maharvest? Maputon na. Oh, ito itong grupo na ito. Dagdaman ng maputon ang grupo. Dagdaman ng gamit. Dagdaman. After the bamboo is flattened, it is very crucial to remove the inner white layer and to clean the board. This step is important because the inner layer is extremely attractive to insects that may cause easy deterioration of the panel. At this point, the crushed bamboo panels are brushed and washed properly to remove any dirt and debris. These are then allowed to dry for a few days. At this point, the panels can now be used. But if you want the panels to last much longer, another step is done. When the bamboo mats are cleaned and dried, the next step is to preserve them against future insect attacks and molds. This is done by submerging the bamboo in tanks with a mixture of non-toxic preservatives and water for several days. Finally, after all the panels are treated, the drying process can start. Air drying of crushed bamboo may take about one to two months. Bamboo is one of the fastest growing plants in the world. Flexible and lightweight, bamboo is a sustainable building material that is actually stronger than wood, bricks, or even concrete. More and more people have now recognized bamboo as an alternative constructor material. Bamboo has a very strong fiber, and the compressive strength of bamboo is two times higher than concrete, while the tensile strength is close to steel. Bamboo fiber has a shear stress that is higher than wood and when treated and maintained properly, bamboo has longer lifespan than wood. I hope you enjoyed our adventure today and until next time here in Verniculture.